Hi everybody and welcome to White Sky's Wisdom. I'm going to do a review of these beautiful cards, Animal Voices, Connecting with Our Endangered Friends by Chip Richards. Artwork by Susan Ferrell. <coughs> now these cards are made for kids. Wisdom Cards for Kids, 31 cards and guidebook. It says on the back, not so long ago, the people of our world knew that all life was connected to the heartbeat of Mother Earth. From the mighty whale to the tiny bee, every living being brings a unique and special gift. When eagle takes flight, she helps us see new possibilities. When gecko calls out, it reminds us to listen to our heart. When the wind changes direction or the sun comes out from the clouds, it brings a spe special message just for you. Animal Voices shares a unique message from our planet's most endangered species. They are calling to all of us now. If you listen closely, they will share with you their wisdom and teach you to walk in peace with all creation. Listen to the whispered call of Animal Voices. That message is a gift, or all gift is calling to you. Okay. All right, the box is sturdy, good for kids. The lid's easy to take off. Beautiful color. All right, the guidebook itself. Oh, it's a nice, decent size guidebook. Okay, so it looks like they're broken into the elements, water, earth, air, fire and wood. Also a section on endangered animal insights. The artwork is absolutely exceptional. Look at that. All right, it gives a little um, spiel on how to use the cards. Now for younger children, I think an adult would be able to read this for them, but for older kids, I'm sure they'll be able to read this uh, Words look um, quite large on the page. It also gives um, an indication of how to do a spread, just a basic spread, just to get kids into Oracle card use. With above, below, south, west, north and east and the different elements that coincide with it. So east is fire, south is water, west is earth, North is air, above is wood, below is wood. And it has a section here on the card's messages themselves. So the first card, and they're numbered, which makes it easy, is water. Water represents feeling, expression, and flow. The gift, water cleanses us quenches our thirst and wakes us up. Water flows through obstacles, removes barriers, breaks down mountains and awakens life. Water slips through the tiniest cracks and carry our biggest boats with the greatest of ease. Water brings life to our bodies and our whole planet. Did you know that 70% of our planet is covered with water and 70% of our bodies is full of water too? The message. Water teaches us that when we listen to the current of the quiet voice inside, it always takes us to good places. The message water has for you is to trust your heart and go with the flow. Water is one of the most powerful elements, but it never forces anything. You can do great things right now by simply following the energy of what feels most exciting to you. The call, go to the edge of the ocean lake or stream and say a prayer of thank you for all the gifts that water brings. Ask if it has a message for you today. Fill the water with your hands. Fill the water with your feet. Splash your face and give thanks for the water of life. So there's the elements but there's also the animals. The blue whale polar bear, friendship, strength, alone time, the sea turtle, the 
the shark. Focus, action and fear. So here's the earth and there'd be animals that are endangered on our beautiful earth. Mountain gorilla, the elephant, responsibility, cooperation, empathy. Air element, the eagle, vision, freedom and inspiration. The masked owl. Fire element, in the name of fire, the flame and the light, praise the pure presence of fire that burns within without thought of time. By John Adu. Wild horse. The blue lotus butterfly. The wood element. We must protect our forests for our children, grandchildren and children yet to be born. We must protect the forests for those who can't speak for themselves, such as the birds, the animals, fish and the trees. Never a true word was said. The dearly beloved orangutan. Beautiful creature on the brink of extinction. The koala. I have koalas in my backyard. I'm so blessed. I hear the male call quite regularly. What's his gift? Calm, imagination and ease. Gaia, Mother Earth. Harmony, abundance and life. and some insights into some endangered animals. It's a very, very nice guidebook. Good to teach kids about how important it is to protect our Mother Earth and the animals and creatures that live on it. Artwork's beautiful. Okay, so I'm quite impressed with that guidebook. Now the cards. Now they're quite small, perfect. Little kids can grab them easily. And quite small. That beautiful sea turtle on it, on the back of them. The cards themselves, as I said, are numbered. So when a child picks the number, you can go easily to the guidebook. Oh, and they're actually coloured. And this one's a cream colour compared to the water, which is a bluish colour. Red for, for the air elements. All right. So I'll just pick one at random here. Oh, that one wants to come out. That was quick. Earth. Body, action, planting seeds. It shows what's above is so below. And the roots going down into the soil, the plant with its energy pushing up through the earth. Well, let's see what earth has to say. Beautiful card. Number seven. Earth, the gift. Our planet is four and a half billion years old. Her surface is covered by 70% water, but one underneath all that water are mountains and canyons of sand, soil, stone and clay, earth. The native people of many lands, uh, sorry, to the people of nat uh, many lands, earth is a great healer and giver of life. Even science discovered great health comes from simply walking and standing bare feet on the earth today. The call, step outside. Take your shoes off, stand there, be. If you have an idea or dream, but you don't know where to begin, take time to sit, stand, or walk barefoot in the grass, sand or soil. Feel the earth connect with, you, with your own heartbeat and soon you will know what to do. If your life was a garden of your most special dreams, which dream seed 
would you like to plant today? Absolutely beautiful. So yeah, a really good inspirational deck for young kids. Not just it gets them into um, oracle cards and looking within and connecting with themselves, also the planet, but it also teaches them about how important our um, endangered animals are. And to, to get the kids to really focus on these beautiful creatures and hopefully the next generation will be even more inspired to protect these beautiful endangered animals. So I thank you for watching this unbiased review of Animal Voices by Chip Richards. So if you'd like to like, share, subscribe and hit that bell button so you can get informed of any new videos I post, I'd like to wish you many blessings. Goodbye.